Hey, welcome back to the Big Ranch Show. As always, thank you for joining me. If you could, hit the subscribe button down below. Let's get right to it. Now, I just want to bring you a quick update on the Jasmine Barnes case. Of course, I brought you the story yesterday about seven-year-old Jasmine Barnes who was gunned down in a car with her, pa with her mother and two siblings on December 30th of 2018. Both sus two suspects have been arrested. Of course, I mentioned yesterday that one, Eric Black Jr., 20, of the Houston area, was arrested. There's also been a second arrest made. Apparently, he has not been completely charged in the case, but is con um, looking to be charged probably by today or tomorrow. Um, prosecutors say his name is Larry Woodruff. And... These two gentlemen are responsible for the death of seven-year-old Jasmine Barnes. Now, initially, of course, it was um, thought to be a, a white individual driving a pickup truck. It turns out that the guy in the pickup truck had nothing to do with it. I want to make that clear. Police are uh, making it, trying to make it very clear because, as um, Sean Lee has probably has pointed out, or Sean King, I'm sorry, has pointed out um, the guy is probably fearing for his life and probably in hiding because there are probably a lot of people that may not have gotten the memo. So just to make it clear, the guy that was initially considered to be part of it, all he did was witness what happened. These two individuals are the ones responsible. Eric Black uh, has said that he was the one driving the car and that the other guy was the one that pulled the trigger from the passenger seat. As well, the, uh, the Sheriff's Department said that they believe that um, that the other guy was just a witness and that they believe it was just kind of dark and because of the, you know, the tra traumatic uh, situation, um, they weren't really able to give a proper um, I identity of the people who did the attack considering it was kind of dark in the morning and, the, you know, they had just undergone such a tragic event. Um, but hopefully the guy in the red truck can be found and hopefully he will be able to come forward with some information to help put these two pieces of crap away. But that's all I want to do is give you a quick little update. There hasn't been a whole lot of information given, except that Larry Woodruff was arrested, um, on drug charges. Um, was, he was accused of having more than 120 Xanax pills in his possession. Uh, Mr. B um, Black says that the whole thing was a case of mistaken identity. So these two assholes were going to kill somebody anyway. It just so happens that it was a seven-year-old child. I don't support the death penalty in very many cases. This is one of those cases I hope they spend their, the rest of their life on death row and end up getting a lethal injection. I'm not the biggest supporter of it, but if you're going to murder a child, you deserve the death penalty. Case closed. Anyhow, this has been the Big Ranch Show. I've been your host, Jacob Keck, and I'll see you down the road.